And today we're going to learn all about the letter Q. Are you ready to learn about the letter Q and make letter Q art? <gasps> Me too, I am so excited. What words begin with the letter Q? There's qu queen, qu quail, hmm, what else? Qu quiet, and qu question. They all begin with the letter Q. I know, why don't we pretend to be a quail? Now a quail is a little bird. It kind of looks like a chicken, like a small wild chicken. And it has a little feather on the top of its head like this. Little feather, so we can pretend to be a quail. Beep, beep, beep. 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 So good. How cute is that? I love quails. They're so cute. All right, let's do our warm up. Are you ready to warm up? If you are, give me a thumbs up. All right, let's get started. Hands up high, touch the sky. Wave them around, up so high. Hands down low, touch your toes. Wiggle and giggle, see how it goes. Hands to the side, now let's clap. Clap and smile in a snap. Hands up front, then back in, ready to learn. Let's begin. Let's do some adding. We're going to find out how many queens there are all together. The total number or sum of all the queens. Now we can count all of them. Count all until we get the total or we can add. In one group we have five queens. We can see there's one, two, three, four, five. Five queens in the first group. Over here in the second group, we have two queens. One, two. So we are, our equation is five plus two. Five plus two. Five and two more. What does that make? If we have five and we add two, what will we get? Well, we can count on from five to find out. If we have five and we're gonna count on two more, we can find the total for five plus two. Let's start from five. Five, six, seven. So that means five with two more, make seven. Wow, that wasn't so bad. We could use count on as a strategy. Good job. Let's take a look at a quail and the different parts of a quail. Well, on a quail, we have feathers, the little feather on the head, that cute one, that's called a plume. There's a head, an eye, they have a beak and they have feathers covering their body. We have lots of hair, but they have feathers covering their body. Isn't that cool? Now let's head on over to the art studio where we're going to write the word quail and draw a quail. And then we're going to make an artwork of a queen. See you there. All right. Let's write the letter Q. Let's do an uppercase letter Q by doing a nice big circle and a line across. And then we'll draw a circle for the lowercase with one line down and a little tail up for letter Q. We're gonna draw a quail. So we're gonna write the word quail with a Q. Q, A, I, L for quail. 
let's draw the body like a nice big oval with a pointy at the top. Little plume at the top for the feather on the top. And a triangle on the front or letter V for the beak. And we'll add a little eye, coloring it in black, leaving a little bit of white. Draw a curving line down to a point for the wing. And we'll add some zigzag lines for the tail. And we'll add some legs. And some lines in the wing for the texture of the feathers. And then you can color in your quail using choice colors and art mediums. Just like that, your quail is done. Let's make a queen, a queen. Let's grab a purple. Let's draw a big U shape. Cross. Let's draw a line above. We're going to make a crown right above her head. Let's draw a line up on each side. Zigzag lines across to connect. Let's draw curving lines around for the hair. Let's draw a nose with a little curving line. And a smile with a big wide line. On each side we'll draw a circle. And in each circle we'll draw another circle. Let's color in the dark of the eyes, leaving those circles white. Let's paint the face. You can grab a face color. I'm just going to use an orange. You can use any color you want.
Stay Power brush in paint color for our hair. I'm gonna do brown, but you can paint whatever color you want. And we can go and grab a crown color. I'm going to do a yellow. And if you want, you can grab a little bit of pink and add pink underneath each eye to make little cheeks and just like that, your queen is done. Hi my friends. Thank you so much for learning with me today. I am so glad that you joined me made my heart full. I hope to see you in our next learning adventure together. Parents and teachers, for more art ideas for kids, visit artastickids.com or for teachers, you can go and find art lesson plans at the Ms. Artastic Teachers Pay Teachers store by searching Ms. Artastic on TPT. Links below and in the description of the video. See you next time!